Backyard Bones, a pool project, turns into a prehistoric discovery. Fox House Lauren Martinez joins us live at the site of the excavation. What a find. Yeah, Jacqueline and John, we're at a home near Floyd Lamb Park, and as you can see, we are standing inside of a pool under construction, but everything stopped when contractors unearthed these bones. This is the part of the spinal cord, and this is uh, to the arm. Bones dating back to the Ice Age were discovered by contractors digging up a couple's pool in northwest Las Vegas. The pool contractor alerted Metro first since they didn't know who or what they belonged to. Took some pictures, looked at it, told us that it wasn't human. It's too big for that and wasn't their concern anymore and left. Police told Matthew Perkins and his husband it's up to them what they want to do, cover it up with construction or throw them away. Instead, the couple got in touch with a local paleontologist. These, and the way we'll be able to identify which species of horse is that these little wiggles of enamel in there are specific to each species of horse, like whether you have a donkey, a zebra, or a horse or a mule. Bondi was able to identify the bones belong to a horse. Half of its right jaw and some teeth were found within several historic layers. It's a kind of a greenish clay, and that greenish clay is about 14,000 years old. And so the bones are found right between that and some younger gravels that date between six and 9,000 years old. Bondi says fossils like this are common across the northern end of the valley. There's Ice Age Fossil State Park, there's Tule Springs Fossil Beds National Monument, both less than a mile from where this discovery was made. So it's actually surprising that we don't encounter more bones on private property, at least on that side of the valley. Perkins and his husband feel that if it offers any scientific importance, it's worth preserving. I love history. My husband has a science degree. If this is something that can help history and science, then it, that's more important to us than having our pool by the 4th of July. Now the plan is to excavate as much as they can, just as long as it doesn't go under the foundation of the house. Now in the United States, if you find a fossil on private property, it belongs to the landowner. So the couple are going to decide what to do with the bones from here. Reporting live from Northwest Las Vegas, Lauren Martinez, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.